Shooter starts behind the left barricade, rifle fully loaded, held at low ready, pistol fully loaded and holstered. At the buzzer, Shooter will engage the two steel targets with two hits each, no double taps. One, two, one, two. All shots must be from within the confines of the hula hoop. The shooter will then move to the barrel, engage the steel targets same way, two hits, no double taps. Shooter's rifle must be in contact with the barrel at all times. Shooter will then move to box A, the yellow box, and engage each target two times, same thing again, one, two, one, two. Shooter will then move to the table, ground rifle, and neutralize all six steel targets. All paper on this stage are considered no shoots. Each hole in the target is a 15 second penalty. Not firing in the manner prescribed will result in a five second penalty per shot. All other standard rules apply. Hit! 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 Right arm of the free world. Hit! 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 Shoot at it. Shoot at it. Move! Yeah, just send a round at it. Wow. Okay. Time to reconfigure to AR mode. Reconfiguration complete. Shooter's ready. Stand by. Hit. 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 Move. Hit. 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 Move. Move! For what? Switching guns. I didn't want to fight through malfunctions. How many did you have on that stage? Four or five. Yeah, Oops. not not something I wanted to deal with. Oh, Fortunately, our American allies gave me one of these. Yeah. Well, this is why the Israelis got rid of the foul. Uh, I honestly don't know what's going on with it right now. All of my malfunctions have been failure for the empty case to get fully clear of the action. Maybe it's got a bad ejector spring in it or something, or ejector. I don't know. And I'm probably not going to find out here today at the match. I'm just going to push through it for one more stage. It seems to be accelerating on every stage, like a little bit more on every one. Maybe. I don't know. It's depressing to think about. Uh, the pistol was also depressing to think about. That was, uh, I actually opted to, in fact you did the same thing, I think, to shoot the, the swinger plates before shooting, before uh, allowing the swinger to start moving. Right. Well, from a competitive standpoint, once somebody else does it, that's the best way to shoot the stage. If the, if the activator has been mandated first, it would have completely changed the shooting challenge. 
But uh, part of my plan on that was I engaged the bottom ones that were free of the no-shoots first, so I knew that I was on target. I just switched out the uh, iron sights on the SIG 226 I'm using, so not entirely familiar with them, but it didn't seem to make a difference because I got right on those and cleaned yeah. them all. So. Nice. Uh, I shot the two plates and I accidentally, I, I, was it the first plate that I knocked down uh, bumped the spinner enough that it started moving um, unintentionally. So I had one that I had to shoot, excuse me, while spinning. Um, I was very, very happy to not hit, man, I've got hiccups now. I was very happy to not hit any of the, the no-shoots in the back. So, overall, it actually didn't feel like a bad stage to me, although you beat me by like a minute. Uh, you know, sh shooting iron sights, like I don't think people understand how much more difficult that is than, than using modern optics because particularly with those uh, mini F6 in the shadow at the back of the bay, you get behind the sights, like they kind of just blend into the background, depending on the angle you're looking at them from and where the light's at. So I had some extra shots on those, but um, you know, still cleaned them all. So. One thing I have to say is while I had issues with malfunctions, I felt like I was getting really good sight pictures and really good hits, despite the iron sights and despite the less than competition grade trigger. Well, you freaking killed that one, knocked it all the way off. This is so. true, yes. I, although, to be fair, that was actually a bad shot because it was a slightly low shot that went straight through the stick, um, but I'll take it. Screw you, target. Yeah, you're not gonna knock over a steel plate like that with 5.56. Five, all right, well, we've got one more um, for me to shoot and you to whatever gamer out. Crush. Yeah, that. 